Hi guys, this is going to be a collective. All right, welcome back. I'm going to post um, all elements in a second, fire, water, air, and earth for you guys, but I'm going to get a collective in first. I forgot to grab the deck. I knew I was going to forget something. Oh. Get a couple messages here. All right, for the collective. All right, let's see. What's the messages for the collective here? And right after this, I will be posting each element. If you want your individual sign, you will have to go follow me or subscribe to my OnlyFans. The link will be on my community tab, guys. You have to go there and get it unless you follow me on Instagram and you can click the link in my bio. All right, because they have, they delete it when I put it in the comments or if I put it in the um, description box. So you have to go on my community tab and click it and, and um, get your sign, your individual sign. I will only be doing collectives and little stuff here. All right. Make sure to follow me on Instagram too. You guys be missing it when we go, when I go uh live over there and they and you you have to make sure that you come to my lives when i tell you i'm going live because you may not be notified when i'm live a lot of you are telling me you're not being notified okay so that's something that they're setting up behind the scenes with they grimy fucking ass so you have to make sure you pay attention when i say i'm going live all right if you guys want to see me you can see me live tonight on my instagram 9 p.m eastern time all right 9 p.m. Eastern Time. I will be live on my Instagram. Or oh, 10 p.m. Eastern Time. I'm sorry. 10 p.m. Eastern Standard Time. I will be live on my IG doing readings, laughing, kicking it, talking. Okay? So, we have the music card out. Magician, Snake Charm, the Harmony, Melodic. Okay? All right? So, so somebody may be wanting to charm you or seduce you. That, that card reminds me of like... The Knight of Cups. Yeah, we have Roll the Dice, Take a Chance, Risk, Leap of Faith, and Strategy. Someone's going to take a leap of faith to apologize, to offer something to you, or or possibly something like that. I feel like somebody wants to seduce you. All right, let's see what's coming out. We have Toxic Relationship, and then we have Breakup. Yeah, Walking Away, Ending Separation is over. Okay, so legal matters. Yeah, I feel like it's a divorce. It says Justice, Divorce, Balance, and Judgment. I feel like there's a toxic relationship, karmic relationship that's over. I feel like someone's walking away and, they, and, and it's just over for them. Yeah. And they're going straight into a new love. Yeah. Honeymoon phase, child, like moving on and new beginnings. Yeah. I feel like, yeah, I saw a third party. Yeah. I feel like it's a new love here. Yeah. That somebody wants to heal or this is somebody from that somebody's familiar with from their past that they want to go back towards. But they're leaving this toxic shit behind. What's the new love? I feel like somebody uh, wants out of a, a, a relationship here. Yeah, romantic feelings, falling in love, affection, happiness, and emotions. We have anxiety and legal matters. Yeah, so divorce, justice, judgment, and anxiety. Depression, it's, uh, depression, stress, panic attacks, and rest, restless. Fuck. Okay, yeah, and restless. Okay, someone's having anxiety here about um, a situation. Someone's having anxiety about a legal matter or about a divorce or someone's having anxiety about uh yeah spiritual awakening and magnetic attraction yeah yeah i'm definitely getting a divorce a breakup an ending or somebody's just walking the fuck away yeah fear afraid uneasy suspicious somebody's scared as fuck 
of a legal matter or divorce or something about or, or something here. Yeah, or something about a third party interference, cheating, competition, and mystery. So this could be somebody else that's worried. This could be the toxic relationship, the karmic or whatever. Okay, yeah. Yeah, reconciliation. Yeah, Re reunion, second chance, back together, I miss you. Or you're scared about getting back together with somebody, these feelings that you have for somebody, this reconciliation. Maybe, maybe being at somebody's home. Yeah, and faded meeting. Yes, yeah, like there's a rec there's a worry here. Yes, yeah, spiritual awakening. Yes, yeah, as enlightenment, epiphany, life lessons, and rebirth. What is this anxiety of fear? Yeah, somebody is like, yeah, the truth, relationship, finances, and secret crush. What is this anxiety and fear? Somebody really has a lot of fear, anxiety, panic attacks, worry. Uh, I would yeah, ghosted. Yeah, disappear, silence, ignored, and rejected. So somebody has a fear here because they ghosted you, rejected you, or this is, or somebody feels guilty about doing this. Yeah, surrender. Okay, letting go, uh, release, give up, and patience. I don't know. I just feel like somebody here could be a bit, I don't know, worried. Yeah, yeah they ghosted you or you ghosted them. Yeah, someone has fear that you're going to ghost them or... They have fear and anxiety about ghosting you. Yeah, relationship and truth. So somebody wants to give you the truth of why they were they ghosted you or acted like this, but it gives them anxiety. Yeah, relationship. It, it says commitment, partner, boyfriend, and girlfriend with truth. Confession, clarity, reveal, and secret. So somebody could be afraid to confess that they have their inner relationship or they're with somebody. Yeah, the hookup and date. Or that they, or, okay, yeah. Somebody may have hooked up with you or just dated you or, or or wanted sex, but they're in a relationship. Yeah, okay, or something. Yeah, this is giving stupid. Okay, but we do have um new love and romantic feelings here. Yeah, storm warning, upheaval, obstacle, wrecking ball, and drama. And so should we. So this could, these feelings could have somebody. What's new love and romantic feelings? New love and romantic feelings. Yeah, third party. It's, yeah, interference, cheating, competition, and mistress. Yeah. So I feel like it's a third party, but there's a, there's somebody here. Yeah, this could be online, social media, spying, online dating, reminiscing, and networking. Yeah, storm warning and intuition. Yeah. So this is third parties online or this new love or these romantic feelings or something like that. Yeah, intuition. Yeah, upheaval, wrecking ball, and then intuition. Yeah. What what what's happening over here though? What is this? Yeah, um, single and ex lover. Yeah, so th this is a breakup, a divorce. Somebody could be single now, or somebody wants to be single, or somebody, something like that. All right. Um. Yeah, a hookup, one night stand, intimacy, casual relationship, and fling, and then reconciliation, reunion, second chance, back together. I miss you. So maybe you're getting back together for a one night stay. Yeah, heartbreak and magnetic attraction. Yeah, it's like heartbreak. Yeah, hurt, betrayal, grief, and disappointment. Magnetic attract. But it's like you have this magnetic attraction. It's like I don't know. Yeah, I would be careful. Snake. Yeah, de deception, shady, temptation, and enemy. What's the snake? All right, I would be careful here because somebody is um. Yeah, faded, hit, hit, yeah, mask. You see, hidden motives, concealed, disguise, and lying. We have faded, meant to be destiny, predetermined, encounter wounds, improving, mending, and progress. So somebody definitely is a snake here. Snake and mask. Yeah, storm warning. Yeah, upheaval, obstacles, wrecking ball. I feel like somebody, uh, be careful about these energies coming towards you. Somebody could be trying to send you energies, motherfuckers to take you off your life path or spiritual path or to cause storms and shit like that or upheaval in your life or whatever. Yeah, we have regret, mistake, guilt, and wrong choice. You're going to regret it if you get involved with this person because they're a snake, they're wearing a mask, or they're trying to cause upheaval. Yeah, spiritual awakening, enlightenment, epiphany, life lessons, and rebirth. I feel like you're going to awaken to this or you're going to realize this or, yeah, unexpected, surprise, unpredictable, shocking, and unusual. Yeah, what what is this? Maybe you're getting an un, uh, um, yeah, unfinished business. It's not over patterns back and forth. What's this? Unexpected? Something's going to, yes, twin flame. Yeah, soulmate contract, soul connect. Someone's going to be shocked to see something from their, from their twin flame on their phone. They're going to be like, what the fuck? Yeah, there's unfinished business. What's the twin? 
Oh God, what's the two? I cannot. Yeah, we have intuition. Yeah, this could be a tarot reader. Your yeah, gut feeling, psychic premonition, and sixth sense. Yeah, this yeah magnetic attraction. Yeah, alluring, lust, irresistible, and flirting. Yeah, and text message. There's gonna be flirting and text messages and shit like that. Yeah. Yeah, secret crush admirer, butterflies. Yeah, like this person gives you butterflies. Yeah, serendipity, divine. And you're going to be like, what the fuck? Yeah, I feel like there's unfinished business here with you and somebody. Real shit. Okay. Or, or something like that. Yeah, let's see. Let me see from this one. Collective. Yeah, 1010. Collective, please. What's the messages for the collective? Yeah, so this is somebody online. So I'm definitely getting somebody's having a lot of anxiety about this reconciliation, this truth or whatever. But something from your twin flame is like, what the fuck? You're surprised. You're like, oh my God, what the fuck? What is this unexpected in twin flame? Yeah, they go twin flame again. What is this? Yeah, clock. And there, and I saw the time. What is this? Somebody, you're like, what? Yeah, lightning, sudden change, shocking news, surprise, epiphany, upheaval, and transformation. Somebody is like shocked. Yeah. It could be a Scorpio with the Grim Reaper and this. This is like the Tower card. What is this surprise shit right here? From the from the twin flame? Yeah. Something that's shocking you? Yeah, proposal. I saw a proposal in that deck. It's, yeah, we have heartbroken. Wow. Deeply hurt, sad, separation, breakup, fall, uh, feeling lost, grieving, and mourning. With engagement, engagement, partnership, commitment, eternity, complete completion. Yeah. What's heartbroken? With the um with the um yeah, karmic relationship. Yikes. All right. Fleeting triggers toward more resentment lessons, letting go and loving you. All right. Yeah. And then we have healing from heartbreak, freedom from toxic relationship or addiction. Yeah. I feel like somebody could be going through a breakup or divorce or heartbreak or ending, but I feel like somebody's going to be yeah, healing heart and then heart with the key. Okay. Meet, meeting, welcoming love, meeting the one, open your heart, getting together and perfect. Yeah. We have twin flames there again. Yeah. What's this karmic and heartbroken? Karmic and heartbroken. Because I feel like somebody gonna, somebody's going to be heartbroken here. Yeah, somebody's going to chase her in a codependent relationship, fear of abandonment. So that's somebody's about to get real toxic. Yeah, stabbed in the back. Heartbreak, pain, separation, deception, and shock and attack. Yeah, somebody may even... Yeah, this looks... Yeah, somebody has sunglasses. Somebody could be trying to... Dab somebody in the back. I don't know where that came from. Yeah, the snakes and duck. Yeah, somebody's trying to seduce someone or keep somebody from coming in, going to it. Yeah, mirror, mirror each other, self image, reflection, reflect our wounds. Yeah, somebody needs to do work on themselves. Stop chasing someone to to get them to, I, I don't know, to validate yourself or get them not to leave or whatever this is because this is looking real stupid. Somebody's willing to seduce somebody, fuck somebody, do whatever to get somebody to want them or some shit. Yeah, passion, and then we have insane chemistry, like each other equally, having fun, and then love. Someone expresses love, a message of love, thinking of you and letting you know. Yeah, cute, uh, yeah, cassette, yeah. I just like somebody, yeah, this twin flame, yeah, coffee, meeting, conversing, savoring the moment, feeling uplifted, and friendship. So, yeah, you could be meeting with somebody, yeah, the butterflies, yeah, because I got butterflies right here, and then the butterfly relationship evolving to the next phase, healing the inner child and growth. Yeah, that, yeah, healthy choices. Yeah, somebody, yeah, okay. I'm, I'm definitely getting, you have the key to somebody's heart. I'm definitely getting, yeah, what's this um, right here? Something shocking, twin flame card right there. What's the twin flame? Okay, yeah, we have hammer. Sabotage, rebuilding, interrogation, repetitive persistence and working on it. And we have palm tree. That's what I'm saying. Somebody could definitely build homes. We have stability, security, permanence, growth, endurance, and flexibility. We have addiction flipping out in the reverse. A codependent obsession, possession, controlling, has a block and restraint. So maybe somebody's, yeah, healthy choices. Making healthy choices and loving and life, self-love, self-care, and being happier. So I feel like somebody's, re re yeah, mask, not showing true feelings, high personify, pretend, dilute, and gaslight. All right, what's the uh, mask card? 
Yeah, the sword and rose. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Take a chance, risk being strategic, not showing hand and gambling with sword and rose, clarity, truth, revelation, solidarity, force, honor, protection, and power. I feel like somebody wants you to give you the truth or they want to take the mask off. They're going to take a leap of faith. Yeah, boat, receiving what you need, progression, arriving, moving on, and closure issues and love. Unconditional love, self-love, oneness, passion, affection, and attraction. So, yeah, um, yeah, the runner. So I do feel like somebody, yeah, soulmates and talking. Yeah, so this twin flame, somebody wants to be with you, take a leap of faith, all right, or something like that. I feel like somebody's really uh, crushing on you here. Let's get a couple messages from this deck for the collective. What's this for the collective? Okay, what's the messages here? Collective, please. Clarify this energy, but I feel like there's anxiety about a truth or some truth that were hookup or what is this for the collective? Clarify what's here, please, or something like that. Okay, let's see. Yeah, okay, we got the eight of swords flipping over here. So, okay, what's the eight? So, being stuck or in fear or trapped, what's the eight of swords? I should have, um, yeah, or somebody, this is what somebody um, is trying to do. Yeah, yeah, the Five of Cups. That's what I should, yeah, the Eight of Swords, the Five of Cups, the uh, the King of Swords, and then the Knight of Pentacles. We have the Page of Swords. So I feel like somebody's just watching you or... They're, they're, they're not really doing shit, but they're watching you. Yeah, the Six of Swords. So I thought I saw that card flip over. So the Eight of Swords and the Six of Swords. So if you're feeling stuck or trapped or in fear, I feel like your guides, this is our hidden helpers, are, 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 are getting you out of this or you're, or you're moving on or moving away from it or something. Yeah, the Justice. What's the Five of Cups? Five of Cups, please. You have the Judgment. This could be a reconciliation with an air sign, but yeah, I'm, I'm getting like this awakening or what you're feeling could be, yeah, the Ten of Wands. Yeah, somebody's like under heavy judgment. This could be about a loss. Yeah, the Tower and the Ten of Wands, the Three of Swords. I'm getting like a divorce, a breakup, an ending. Something has to end or something. Or, or the Tower 10 of Wands, Judgment 3. So this is like some heavy shit going on. I'm not sure, really sure what this is. You have the Five of Cups, the King of Swords, and the Page of Swords. So this could definitely be something that's being watched or heard or said. There's a lot of people. There's a bur there's something is burning. Some Ten of Wands, the Tower, and the Three of Swords. This is a breakup. You have the Seven of Wands. Or something is ending. Yeah, the Four of Cups, and you don't give a fuck about it, or you don't care that this is falling apart, or you don't, you don't care. It just period. Yeah, the King and Queen. Of, yeah, so this could definitely be a divorce, a breakup, an ending. The Five of Cups, the Tower, the Three of Swords, and the Ten of Wands. Something is just too much. It's it's too heavy. I'm also getting somebody's like watching you or investigating you. There's a private investigator or the police or some shit. So you could be calling this out. Yeah, the nine of wands. Yeah, the four of pentacles reversed. Yeah, somebody could be annoyed because that because you're open or something is released for you, or they have to release something or let something go where you do. Somebody doesn't like the, the the fact that you're over something or you let something go or something has been let go or whatever the fuck this is. Somebody, yeah, the page of wands. Possibly that you're getting good news or yeah, the death. It, it's this looks like. Something could be definitely be a wrap here. Yeah, the, okay. What's this? I feel like somebody's stressed or sad or feeling... What's the tower? The three, Yeah, I'm getting like either be a lot of people being fired or a divorce. What's the Ten of Wands tower and the Three of Swords, a breakup? It's just like something just is a no. Yeah, the Nine of Wands. See what I'm saying? Like somebody's irritated or offended. So this is something that you're saying. Yeah, with the Queen of Swords that was sticking out. So whatever you're saying is the truth. But I feel like somebody's annoyed or offended by it. They're hurt or they're offended by your truth, what you're saying. You could be very direct or cold or ruthless with what you say. You're like, fuck you. Yeah, yeah, you yeah, the, the, yeah, the fool card. You don't give a fuck. You're going to say it or whatever. Yeah, the devil, the four of wands and the chariot with the five of wands. 
you, or you don't care, or somebody can't do shit to you. Yeah, uh, yeah, the eight of it. So this could be something that you're doing for work. Someone's offended. Bitch, fuck you. Who's offended? What's the nine of wands? But the, yeah, I feel like somebody, it's something you're saying or doing at work. So if you speak, I feel like you say anything and somebody doesn't like it or, okay, so why watch somebody stalk them or whatever if you don't like it? What's the nine of wands and the three of, or if you don't like them? Okay, yeah, the devil. It's with the passion. Somebody is very, yeah, the devil and the eight of cups. It's a Capricorn. Yeah, the four of wands, the chariots, the five of wands. Okay, um, or something like that. What's the, or, or somebody's trying to get you to, yeah, the will of fortune. The devil, the eight of cups in the way, yes. But something is, yes, yeah, because I feel like something is just not going to work or the tables are going to turn or, yeah, what's the will of fortune or you're moving on or you don't give a fuck. Yeah, the, yeah, I'm getting right here. Yeah, the king of swords and the queen of swords. This could be a relationship or a marriage, but I, or it could be a debate or 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 something like that. You, I'm, I'm getting you're not going to debate. You don't give a fuck how somebody feel. The eight of cups, nine of wands, three of swords. Yeah, the chariot. It could be the police or a cancer or yeah, they're gonna cancer again. The chariot, the moon, a double cancer or something to do with the police. Yeah, the justice, the nine of swords. Yeah, this has been coming out lately. Somebody's worried the police or the police academy or, or somebody's worried at night or someone's worried about something here. Either karma, a Libra, a legal matter, a lawsuit. Because I feel like something's going bankrupt or someone's being seen because that five of wands keeps coming out. There's a lot going on over here. What's the nine of swords? And then somebody's scared or worried. Fuck is you worried for? Retarded. What's the nine of swords? In the moon, it's a cancer, a double cancer, or it's the fucking police. Yeah, we got the death card. It's almost as if, what's the death card? It's almost as if somebody, nine of swords in the death card. I feel like laws, regulations, rules, or something is changing. What's the death card? What's happening? Yeah, the five of wands. Somebody doesn't want something. Somebody wants to keep fighting or somebody doesn't want something to change. Yeah, the five of wands, ace of wands. So whatever this competition or conflict is, something is changing. Or, or you're being picked out, you're being picked out of the crowd or picked for what's the five of wands, ace of wands? Yeah. For an opportunity, money, for you're you're being selected. Somebody does not want something to change or want that to happen. You're free, you're moving on, or you're over it, or something's got released for you, and they like, uh. Oh. Yeah, the Eight of Wands, yeah, period. And the Six of Pentacles, yeah, something is progressing quickly here for you. This could be money. This could be whatever fuck it is. The High Font and the Six of Wands. Maybe this is your bank, a loan, a credit union. Uh, 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 um, yeah, the Six of Wands, an uh, entity, a corporate. It could be anything. But you're getting the okay or you're getting something. Something is progressing quickly here for you that you deserve, just period. I feel like somebody's mad about it. Maybe in this divorce. You're divorced somebody, you're leaving something behind, you're walking away from this toxic shit. Somebody's like mad or somebody wants you to walk away from there. There's like somebody, yeah, this devil, this person is obsessed with you. Or they really don't don't fuck with you or something. Yeah, the higher font sticking out. Why? So this is your marriage. I've definitely been got a divorce here. So this is your marriage, a divorce. The higher font and the four of cups. Yeah, I feel like somebody also does not give a fuck about these rules, this regulations, this this shit. Somebody's that somebody doesn't give a fuck about your oath. They're gonna break it. They don't give a fuck about none of that shit. All right, at all zero zilch. They don't give a fuck. Okay, period. All right, I feel like somebody's disinterested and they don't care. They feel like something is faulty. People is crabs or they're dirty or they're rats, so they don't give a fuck anyway or something like that. What's the higher font? Or they're not committed to this marriage. Or, okay, if it's not a thing, they're not committed to this marriage or whatever the fuck this is. What's the Empress? The hard fight the Empress. Yeah, they, here somebody is. Knight of Swords attacking someone. So this is your mother or someone's attack, attacking this, this Empress Nine of Pentacles energy. So this could be the government or somebody or or something. What's the Knight of Swords? Because the hard fight is here. Or this is someone you're married to. Or an entity. What's the Knight of Swords? They have the Five of Pentacles. Yeah, somebody is like bullying you, attacking you, or yeah, because we're going like, or somebody's trying to make you into. Yeah, this is over. The World card. Somebody knows it. Somebody knows that they fucked up, but that is over. The yeah, the Ace of Swords. A truth is here, or something is coming out, or whatever. Okay, yeah. What's the um? What's this over here? Nine of Swords and the Justice. Yeah, the Four of Cups and the Seven of Cups and the Justice. 
All right, there it is again, the nine of wands. Someone, someone's worried, someone's confused as to why something isn't working or what, yeah, the justice or about a law con or, or something. What is this person um, scared of? What's, what's this over here? What's the nine of wands and the three of swords with the devil? Nine of wands, three of swords and the devil. Yeah, the seven of wands. Yeah, because you keep defending yourself or standing up or you don't give a fuck. Yeah, the empress and the three of swords. Yeah, somebody's hurt. This is an ex or your mother. Or a Capricorn or a Libra or Three of Swords and the Empress. Yeah, the Page of Swords and the Tower. What's the Three of Swords? Yeah, somebody keep attacking you. This Knight of Swords keeps coming at you. And the Ten of Swords. What's the Empress and the Three of Swords? Nine of Swords. Yeah, somebody just don't like you because you don't give a fuck. Yeah, the Seven of Swords in reverse. You keep you keep catching them in lies or you, or you just don't give a fuck. Yeah, what's this right here? What's this Empress in this Three of Swords, though? The Four of Pentacles. I feel like somebody just wants to, I, I don't know. Yeah, something is secure or you are protected. Yeah, the Nine of Cups in the Star or something is restored or the Lovers or, or, or Gemini or whatever this is. You're protected. Yeah, the King of Cups or somebody's in love with you or whatever. All right, yeah. What's the Tower of the Justice and all, and all this? Yeah, oh, see the chariot again. Something about the police. What's the Nine of Swords here? Yeah, somebody is like really worried. I'm, I won't be surprised if the Nine of Swords comes out again. Somebody's confused as to why something isn't working. Why it's not going to work. Why isn't this working? What the fuck is going on? What is this right here? Tell me more about what this, this Seven of Cups is. Yeah, because you know something. Tell me more about the Seven of Cups, Four of Cups, the Chariot. Who is this police with the Justice and the Nine of Swords? I feel like this is the police, a police academy, or what's the Chariot here? Yeah, the Four of Wands. Something about a home or the police or this cancer. Yeah, the, yeah somebody's watching, listening, or doing some shit here. Yeah, the devil. In the fight, yeah, somebody's trying to force something or force you to or, or or get you to do something, bitch, or not, or or okay, or make you homeless, okay. Yeah, the tower and the devil, yeah, somebody's like, what, what's the tower? And it's a Scorpio or a Capricorn, and they're watching you, and they're and they're and, and somebody, I, I don't know what this obsessive shit, what's the tower and the devil, and okay, what's this? Yeah, the world, whatever it is, it's over, that's what the fuck it is, yeah. What is the nine of swords? What is somebody staying up at night worried and anxiety and scared? Yeah, because anxiety and fear came out right here too. Somebody knows this is not going to fucking work, bitch. What's the nine of swords? Yeah, it's just not. Yeah, we have the will of fortune, the fool. Yeah, something's changing. Yeah, the king of pentacles, six of wands, ace of wands, the eight of pentacles. You have the green light, you're happy, your work. Yeah, something is right on time. Someone's worried about you getting this yes, being free, moving on, something changing, your destiny. Somebody just knows they can't do shit about it. Yeah, the five of cups. What's the nine of swords, five of cups, the page of pentacles? You don't see them as a friend. You don't trust them. Yeah, the nine of wands. Someone's annoyed. Five of cups in the um nine of wands. With the tower, yeah, this could be several people. Yeah, this is something about your uh, about what you're saying. You're calling, yeah, you don't, yeah, the judgment. This could be your whole family. Yeah, you don't trust the page of cups in the reverse and the ace of pentacles. Yeah, yeah, there's the nine of swords again. There it is again. Somebody's worried. They have anxiety here about you, you getting something or you having something that you rightfully deserve. Or that they rightfully deserve. So somebody's scared. Bitch, fuck you scared for a hoe. What's the nine of swords? Or somebody can't, I, I don't know. What's the nine of swords? Yeah, the eight of cups. Yeah, it's over. Somebody knows it's over. You're moving on. They, they, they need to move on or something. Yeah, the death card is over. Nine of swords, eight of cups, and the death. I don't, I don't know what the police or whatever's trying to do. Yeah, the five of pentacles, but it's not going to work. Or you're already aware or some shit like that. All right. So I'm about to um um go live here because I have to give y'all some messages that I got on my Instagram last night and I feel like y'all need to hear it too. So come tap in with me. I'm about to post these videos. 
All right. I love y'all. Make sure to go follow me on my IG so y'all can kick shit with us over there. Divine Empress underscore Mommy, M-A-M-I. The link will be in the description box as well as in the comment section. And make sure you go um, subscribe to my OnlyFans. The link will be on my community tab because they will not let me put it in the comment section or in the description box. So you have to go to my community tab or you have to follow me on IG to click the link in my bio for my OnlyFans because that's why I'm going to be doing all signs from now on individually. I'm only going to do like all the elements here, like water together, air together, earth together, fire together here. And over on my OnlyFans will be your individual reading, okay? So I know I'm back on YouTube, but not like that. They still thieves, they still liars, they still cons, and they still, they still can't be trusted. So I'm doing this for y'all because I love y'all, but I'm not finna... Uh, be doing all that over here. So I love y'all. I appreciate y'all and I'll see you in the live.